Hi, this is Nigel Galt, Managing Director and Lead Developer for Olympic Limited. In this short video, I'd like to introduce you to GyroQ for Mime Manager. GyroQ is the latest product that Olympic are now offering for Mime Manager users. And it's basically a Mime Manager add-in that helps you to capture information, uh, particularly when you're interrupted during the day or, or you're, you're in the middle of working and something comes into mind that you, you really want to make a note of and you don't want to forget. Um, so it helps you to reduce distraction um, and helps you to increase and maintain your focus on whatever it is that you're working on. Now uh, GyroQ was conceived and developed by Duronix. Some of you uh, may be aware of Duronix if you're perhaps you're a results manager user for example which is another one of their products. Um, I'm happy to say that Olympic is now the sole distributor globally for Gyronix products. Um, we have also taken over support and hopefully future development. So uh, this year we hope to have some updates for both GyroQ and for uh, Results Manager and also we'll be looking at some other uh, add-ins that we can hopefully bring to market in the next year. So how does GyroQ work? GyroQ is a very small add-in, it's very powerful and once you install it, it sits quietly in the background of Windows um, and when you need it, when, you, you, when you're in the middle of something and you've just had a thought, you activate it with a simple keyboard shortcut. Now the default for that is Control Q. Um, you can change this though if that particular keyboard sequence interferes with another application or perhaps you'd just like to have a different sequence. When you store information and items uh, in Gyro Q, they effectively go into a Q file. Um, and the idea behind that is that that Q file will build up over a period and at a certain point that might be say halfway through the day or at the end of the day or every couple of days perhaps um, you would send the items that have built up into the queue uh, into a My Manager map where you can then uh, view them at a later date, categorize them and maybe move them around and there are some functions around uh, how you can manage that with GyroQ but we will cover those in some future videos but for now we just want to show you the actual core functionality of how you get information from your head uh, or your environment into a map so that it doesn't get lost. So let's take a look at that. I'm going to just jump into our uh, Olympic website so that we're not inside My Manager. My Manager doesn't need to be open for GyroQ to work uh, and also uh, whatever you store in GyroQ um, if you haven't sent that to your uh, My Manager map, if you close your laptop or PC down and you, you're, you're doing multiple sessions, when you restart your PC, the queue will still contain the items you had before, so you don't lose anything. So let's take an example. I've, I'm working through the day, I've had an idea, I press Control Q, and you'll see that the capture window comes up. The default tag uh, that comes up once you've installed it is idea. You can cycle through the different uh, tags that come with GyroQ by pressing Control Q over and over again. So as you do that, the tags will rotate. So I'm going to leave it on idea, and I'm just going to type in there create GyroQ help map. I hit enter to send that item, and if you noticed, the send Q button on the right hand side of the capture window didn't have an asterisk before, but it does now. This now indicates that there is something in the queue. Okay, but that's it. I'm done for the moment. I want to get back on with what I was doing, so I hit escape and I close that window down and I carry on working. Something else comes into my mind and I press Control Q again. I say, okay, I've had another idea. I need to create a small website for Project X. Again, hit enter, hit escape, and I'm back on with my work. GyroQ can also uh, record different types of tags. So we've seen the idea tag, so now I'm going to show you uh, uh, an information tag which can help you when you want to send some uh, clip of text from your clipboard around a particular thing. So I'm just going to scroll down to this uh, text here around Map3. So Map3 is a, as we call it, Map for My Manager add-in. Very, very, very cool add-in. If you haven't got it, have a look at it and check it out. I'm sure that you'll be uh, wanting to get your hands on it when you see what it can do. I'm just going to select that bit of text for it and press Control C to pop that onto my clipboard. I press Control Q to bring up Gyro Q. I then press it again to get the information which has the clipboard functionality. And I'm just going to type in there map 
for mind mind manager fingers all over the place right I hit enter I've added that to the queue and I close it so now I've just had another interruption someone's just come in and said Nigel don't forget you need to call the accountants tomorrow okay. oh, right okay control Q I'm going to control Q again to get an action item and what I'm going to do on there is just type call accountants hit enter hit escape I've also sold them another one so I'm going to go uh, prepare sales reports okay so I've done so I've captured five or six different items now in my queue so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to jump back to my manager and I'm going to go to my demo inbox map for gyro queue now when you install gyro queue for the first time your inbox map will look something like this this is the default one um, but it's important to realize that you can actually designate through gyro queues options a different map to use if you wish which is what I've done here so how do we get that queue in quite simply all we do is hit control Q we're not interested in recording anything here all we're interested in is the send Q function so we're going to click send Q and then that's going to actually bring in the information from the queue into the mind map you can see here that a date topic is created for the date that this information was captured so if I'd have had some ideas in the queue from yesterday that I still hadn't uh, purged into the map then effectively I would have ended up with two topics one with yesterday's date and the information I had captured under that and one for today's date and the information I've captured under that you can see that my ideas have come in with a light bulb icon to indicate that and you can see that my information has come in with an information app uh, icon you can also see that the text that I copied to the clipboard has been added to the topic notes on the action items you can see that they've actually gone into a default project um, with already with progr task progress icons ready for me to start um, actioning those and, and building them out when I have more time. So that's how the information gets into uh, your, your gyro queue daily dashboard. So I'm just going to jump back now and we'll cover off some other small items on this. So the My Manager versions that GyroQ is available for is for 2012, Mindjet 11, 14, 15, 2016 and 2017. So um, this is something that can still be used by uh, My Manager users if you're still running an older version. There's no reason why you can't download this and have a play and actually get to use this uh, uh, really really cool tool to give you a, a really good advantage in sorting out your day um, some further information for you there's a 14-day trial uh, you can download that from the Olympic website um, the trial is a pro edition as there are two editions of gyro Q uh, if you can check the Olympic website and also the gyro Q help which is uh, available once you install the product for the different differences so that you can make an informed decision when you come to purchase and on purchasing um, the single user license for gyro Q pro is currently 59 pounds uh, the gyro Q essentials uh, version is 35 pounds and if you're already a gyro Q uh, pro or essentials user from a previous version and you're moving to my manager 2017 then there is a compatibility upgrade for that for 25 pounds as I said there's more information on the Olympic website the domain is there and uh, if you've got any questions or you would like more information then please feel free to email me uh, as you can see it's nigel.gault at olympic-limited.uk so I hope that quick overview has given you a, a taste of how GyroQ uh, can help you sort out the distractions of your uh, of your daily life uh, when you're using your PC as I said uh, it's a very very small add-in but it is very very powerful and the advanced features we hope to cover in detail uh, in some upcoming videos and tutorials so that you can really see how to fine-tune this and get the best from it so thank you for watching and until next time goodbye